So hopefully it's going to be a big day today with any luck, with a few more little tweaks and connections and filling, I should be able to start the engine. I've reconditioned now the dynamo. So I've spent quite a lot of time on that, taking it apart, sorted it out, put new brushes on. I've got the coil in. Uh, I have the carburetors are set up. I've got to put the vacuum hose, vacuum hose, vacuum pipe on in a second. Radiator I've pressure tested and I've fitted that on. So it just needs uh, putting some coolant in. Uh, the starter switch is in. The fuel pump, I'm just right at the very moment, uh, just uh, making the car final connections and I'll, uh, I'll feed that into a petrol can. Uh, then battery in, uh, a few leads to connect to give me some power and uh, we'll give it a go. Are you all right? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's definitely recording because that would be the worst thing. Yes, yeah. definitely <laughs> recording. Right, okay, fuel pump, fuel on, fuel on, fuel on. Spark on this one. All right, ready? Yep. Okay. Where's, it, oh, where's the spanner for the? Uh, I, I can switch off the ignition here. Okay. Oh, wow, it's done! <laughs> <It's first time! laughs> So I expect there's some doubt as that was the first time that the engine, we tried to start the engine and it started first time, but it actually did. So I'm very, very pleased uh, that uh, we got that going. So that's a major step forward in the project. Um, I'm not going to try again. That's once is enough. Um, and now I can uh, be a bit more relaxed, I think, about the, uh, that the engine built was built okay. And uh, back on the body next. Uh, to repair those uh, pinprick holes I've got uh, after sandblasting.